50 minutes. 50 minutes is the time that the DFB gives us as the responsible people at the club to get certain processes up and running to make them available again without problems before a referee is authorised to blow full time on a match 2-0 in favour of the away team. Basically this means that if for example the floodlights or certain other things fail and we're not able to fix them within 50 minutes we could lose the match because of something completely unrelated to the game itself. IT and the monitoring of components is really important for match days. We're subject to very strict DFL regulations, and in order to comply with them and also prove that we do, we've mapped many different sensors in PRTG to monitor various components to ensure that stadium operations on match day work perfectly. We started by replacing our existing monitoring solution for classic IT relevant areas such as servers, storage, network, and then very quickly expanded into other areas for example, monitoring our access control, building management technology, video analysis, i.e. things that are absolutely relevant for the other fan departments. And then also gave these departments the opportunity to access the monitoring directly via dedicated shared maps, for example. The ICT at Mines is responsible for, among other things, ensuring that all catering processes and the ticket offices for our fans function properly. Also, that access control works as it should, that our fans can enter without problems, that our press representatives who visit us and the photographers who have to work here on the sidelines have unhindered access to the internet, including information such as match day lineups, tactics, and so on. In other words, the ICT here does more than just classic support, but also provides advice for the individual business processes. Thanks to PRTG and its monitoring, we often stop many problems in our day-to-day -day business before they happen. We can assess thoroughly in advance where we need to intervene, and then I can coordinate the team very early on and get them working on tasks so that they can expand systems or rectify errors before they even happen. Monitoring with Pesla PRTG has helped us to significantly reduce personnel costs, especially in comparison with other clubs that do the same job, namely organising a Bundesliga game. We can now manage this with just two to three people on match day to ensure a smooth operation. Another area where Pesla PRTG has also helped us is monitoring the quality of our hotspots, our Wi-Fi, and ensuring that our fans can access the internet without problems. To ensure this, we operate a very extensive wireless LAN here, and Pesla PRTG actually monitors and reports on the quality of the service we offer our customers. We opted for PRTG in 2017 because we realised that the individual solutions we had been using up until then were very, very time consuming to operate. Above all, we couldn't correlate various areas such as virtualization and the network together. So we looked for a solution that would allow us to monitor this comprehensively. And above all, to look back at historical data when someone says, wow, I had a really bad user experience the other week in order to see what actually happened. And above all, checking on all levels, for example, the network or storage, and bring this into line. We sounded out the market and found Pesla PRTG as a solution that already comes with many, many ready-made sensors. In contrast to some open source solutions where the implementation effort would have been extremely high, we were able to replace our existing solution incredibly quickly and achieve our goals with it.